Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. On this day, November 5, 2013, Home Bancor announced the acquisition of the venerable Natchez Financial Establishment, Britain and Kuntz Bank, which began in the city in 1836. William A. Britton was a partner in W.A. Britton & Company, a Natchez banking house with interests in New Orleans, Louisiana. Britton was also an agent for the Nautilus Insurance Company of New York, a company that issued life insurance policies on slaves. William and his brother Audley C. Britton, along with George Kuntz, established a private banking concern on Main Street in Natchez. In April 1861, that banking firm was dissolved by the outbreak of the Civil War. In order to avail themselves of much-needed funds, Audley Britton and George Kuntz drew a check on a bank in New Orleans, which was then in enemy territory. The infamous Benjamin Butler, military officer of the United States, took the check from the bank representative, endorsed it, and collected the funds from the bank. He then gave the money to the United States government. After the war, William A. Britton sued Butler in an attempt to recover the funds, arguing that Butler's actions were done under his authority as a military officer and were therefore illegal as defined by federal statutes adopted in March 1863. On November 6, 1873, 143 years ago tomorrow, the Circuit Court of the Southern District of New York handed down their decision in favor of the defendant, Benjamin Butler, arguing that the statute of limitations had passed. This is Deanna Bowser, Mississippi Market President of Home Bank, and this is your Natchez History Minute.